let's just have a look back at the highlights then of uh, qualifying with lots and lots of drama. Some of it caused by drivers, some of it caused by the weather, but uh, ultimately two very jumbled grids. So this was the first whack, Diego Menchaca into the barriers at Paddock and the car turning turtle. So we had to stop, retrieve that, get underway again. This Antonio Liuzzi shaking his head. He's the driver coach to Taylor Proto, who's the other driver in that car. Uh, so at the end of Q1 then, it was uh, the high drama of Mirko Bortolotti losing it right at the very end that was the talking point. Q2 got underway with everybody needing to pound out early and try and make sure they got a banker lap in. That was the Bortolotti damage, so Christian Engelhardt unable to take part in Q2. Lots of disappointment and anger at Grata Racing Team. Uh, Q2 stopped early because off went Christopher Meese and he was, as he was getting back onto the road, bang, along came Stefan Ortelli, made contact with him uh, and then we also had very heavy rain that made a wet track for the resumption. So we've got, as I say, two intriguing grids going into tomorrow's races uh, and we look forward to what's going to turn out to be, I'm sure, some great action here at Brands Hatch. Race one is at 10 past 12, race two is at just after half past four, and we will look forward to your company tomorrow. For now, though, from Brands Hatch, with the sun shining once more on this drama-filled day from John Watson and David Addison, it's goodbye.